Welcome to the Homeland Security Special Edition Aerostats and Hovering Systems Report. Israeli payload manufacturers report a growing demand for electro-optical payloads for aerostats. Companies like Contrap, Raphael, and IAI are already manufacturing a variety of sensors tailored for aerostats. One good example is the Contrap Speed A payload, used by the Canadian and Israeli armies. The Speed A is designed especially for aerostats, providing long-range surveillance capabilities and high-resolution images. The U.S. Department of Homeland Security is evaluating a number of aerostat systems for use along the border with Mexico, assisting the Border Patrol operations. Each aerostat system carries a payload of advanced sensor equipment, the same type of sensor equipment that Border Control agents use elsewhere. The systems can typically remain in the air for two weeks to one month at a time. With operational altitudes of up to 5,000 feet, the aerostats can monitor thousands of square miles, provide actionable intelligence, and contribute to border security. There's a special effort in Israel to develop hovering, rapidly deployable eyes in the sky that smartly skirts the usual problems associated with the hovering aircraft. Last year, Israel Aerospace Industries unveiled two functioning prototypes of a hovering platform that launches from a moving vehicle to which it is tethered leaving the heavy power source that usually drags down hovering platforms on the ground below. The new device called Electric Tethered Observation Platform can carry 44 pounds up to 328 feet. It can hover at predetermined altitudes for durations limited only by the power source on the ground, which pipes power to the machine via the tether. Sky Sapiens, another Israeli company, has also developed a system dubbed Hover Mast. And as IHLS learned, similar efforts are being made by other Israeli companies. Scientists want to take Aerostat technology further, much further. A high-altitude reconnaissance and surveillance platform, the integrated sensor in the structure is a tall order. The unmanned airship, which measures 450 feet in length, will soar 70,000 feet above Earth for up to 10 years. Like all blimps, the ISIS is filled with helium but the comparisons end there. Hovering in the stratosphere safely out of range of most surface-to-air or air-to-air -air missiles, ISIS is designed to provide unsurpassed situational awareness with a surveillance range of 187 miles for individuals on the ground and 373 miles for advanced cruise missiles. A new aerostat has been developed to assist first responders. According to the American company TCOM, their new 12M tactical aerostat is designed specifically to meet the needs of first responders who require a compact, mobile surveillance solution that can be quickly deployed and retrieved. With a standard tether length to support an operational altitude of 1,000 feet, TCOM said the 12M tactical aerostat can accommodate a variety of payloads up to 60 pounds. The company added that their aerostat is currently being integrated with the broadband meshable data link and a stabilized turret camera for specific demonstrations. Thank you for watching our special edition. See you at the same time, same place next week. And for further information, click the link below.